You clicked on this video hoping to hear about the possibility of Godzilla attacking other Titans. And that's what you'll get. The recent Godzilla vs. Kong trailer still gives us content to talk about as more film content is released. Not too long ago, some rumored Titanus behemoth figures surfaced on social media, leading us to speculate of a possible reappearance of this titan. Remember that in the film Godzilla King of the Monsters, we witnessed several other titans show up and bow down to the newly crowned Godzilla. This CGI figure has already been designed and developed, so it's not too far-fetched to think that this creature might make a quick reappearance in Godzilla vs. Kong. In the recent trailer, we caught a small detail that further supports this theory. A small lizard figure on a rudimentary map, probably put together by Madison Russell and Josh Valentine. This figure seems to be pinned on top of Brazil. Now which titan do we know comes from this country? Titanus Behemoth, a titan favored by many fans around the world, including us here in Goji Center. But why would Godzilla attack Behemoth if him and the other Titans already submitted to him? In 2019, all Titans were awakened by Ghidorah, who projected an alpha call ordering them to attack and wreak havoc on the globe. They were later pacified by the Orca, a machine designed to communicate with Titans using alpha frequencies. This same methodology could have been used to instigate Godzilla to attack anything and anyone. Remember what Mark Russell stated in the trailer. Godzilla is out there, and he's attacking people, and we don't know why. If Godzilla is out there attacking innocent people, who's to say he won't also attack innocent titans? It is possible that the existence of the mechanized giant could be instigating Godzilla's erratic behaviors, causing him to possibly lay blame on both humanity and other titans. Now that we have a slight idea that Godzilla might show up in Brazil, He's most likely there to pay Titanus Behemoth a small visit, one which may end up badly for our furry friend. Note that this trailer makes Godzilla seem like a villain, so could it be possible that Godzilla kills off Behemoth in an attempt to make the audience feel resentment towards Godzilla? Could this go as far as turning all the other Titans against him? Perhaps this could be a Warner Bros. setup to continue the MonsterVerse as Kong being the main character for the rest of the franchise, as we know that the rights to Godzilla will expire very soon. Having said this, do you think Godzilla will ever reappear in the MonsterVerse? Let us know what your theories are in the comments. Join us next time as we uncover the mysteries of the origins of Kong's battle axe, and how this may just be the most lethal weapon in the MonsterVerse. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.